counting. Okay. Uh, first of all, I want to thank everyone uh, to uh, watch my demo. And um, today I will um, paint first white, black, and gold one. Uh, I want to mention something. I uh, I uh, take uh, seminars with uh, the master of pearls, uh, Peter Faust, and uh, I make some uh, experiment and comes up with uh, a new technique. Okay, so I will show you my technique. Uh, first of all, uh, you you have to clean with alcohol. Okay, your plate. Then you put your pattern drawing, and as usual, you copy it with carbon. Okay, so I copy my drawing. You can see this. Okay. After copying it very well, I don't know if you can see this. Okay. I mix uh, two colors, gray, white gray, and black with pen oil to make the outline, okay? Yeah. I will mix the little. We don't need much, so. It's a pen work, uh, pen uh, oil medium, okay? Can you hear me? Yes. Okay. Thank you. Maya, are you still there? We've lost your sound. Maya, you need to unmute yourself. We've lost your sound. Meeting is being, okay. Got it. Do you hear me now? Yes, I hear you now. Yes. Yes, I hear you now. Okay. I, uh, I do all the uh, pearls, white one, and here the gold one with gray color. And here the connected lines between pearls, I draw them with black as you can see here. Okay, is it clear? At this stage, you can fire it if you want, 
or you keep it to dry and start the next step. Any questions? Okay. At this stage, I will start to put the uh, luster color for pearls and the gold color for the gold pearls. I decided here, here I will make the white pearls, here the gold one, and this is the black pearls. You decide what, uh, whatever you, you want to paint. Uh, I bring my uh, luster, mother of pearl luster. I put some drops of the luster on the tile, on a clean tile, I'm sure. And uh, here it stirs. I mix my luster with some drops of turps. I mix it. Okay. Lena, could you tell us again what did you mix with the luster? Turps. Amaya. <laughs> Sorry, Maya. <laughs> okay. So I will start to paint. Can you see my pearls? Cover my white pearls with the mix of luster and turps. Terebantine. Okay. All the white and here the black one. Record. The big one, the biggest one. Lini has the host to show where is the Jamie, host? you're doing something really weird with your screen. So could you um change the way you're viewing things? Make sure you're muted. Thank you. Okay. Now I will use my gold. Okay. I take gold from the bottle, directly from the bottle. Here I have uh, matte, matte gold, okay? It's a matte gold. You can use brilliant gold, never mind. And I paint my, can you see this? Take your time, okay, while painting. Now I'm, I'm in hurry, but uh, take your time while painting. Okay, uh, I won't do everything. I have the second step here. After firing, you have the gold and the mother of pearl on, on the pearls. Okay, can you see this? Hmm. 
after firing it at 780 degrees, uh, this is the longest uh, stage, okay? So uh, we, can, we will start to put colors. I will clean here. Every time you have to clean. I mix my color with MX55, 54. You can use Copaiba too. It's a closed medium. Only with MX. Uh, a little fluid. I add here some MX on my tile for my brushes. I have here turps. And I will use this one. And this brush, this tool brush for the pearls. I start with the, I will start with the white pearls. I condition my clean brush. I condition it. I take from this side, from the edge, color. So you will have, when you paint, you will have one side the color, you can see the line. Okay, so I repeat. The lower side is pink. I painted with pink color. I can make two before it dry. Okay, here. And I clean my brush. I use my gray color for the upper side, for the upper side of the pearl. Here we're painting the white pearls. There's two color on the white pearls on top of luster, mother of pearl luster, pink in the lower side and gray on the upper side. I clean my brush with turds. I clean it very good. And I, make like two brackets here, two brackets, one, two, one, two. Uh, 
I put a dot, a dot of a gray color in the middle, in the center of the white pearl here and here. Okay, this is gray. And I take my stippler. Oh, sorry, my stippler. Can you see this? Yeah. To blend, to blend the color. Before make. Uh, every two, let's say every two uh, pearls before the paint dries, because you you have to blend the color very well. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Ooh, one minute. We can see this. Can you see this? Okay. okay. If you need, I I will do after after this using the stippler. I open here again the light to show the underneath the color. And if you need again to, the, to use the stippler, use it. This is for the pearl, the white pearl. For the black pearl, I clean my brush. I mix uh, black color and purple color together. This, uh, this make the color, the black color more intense. Here the Black pearl. I just put the color. I'm on. I clean the edge with my brush. Hmm. And now I'll wipe out uh, some of the black color with the brush using with the clean brush with okay in the highlight i add one the drop of green you choose the green i i choose the emerald green you choose the whatever green you want i think it's it will give the pearl a nice 
texture and color later after firing, you use the stippler again to blend. And take out, take off, wipe off. Wipe off the color again. Where I want, we have to take in consideration the highlights, you know, and the shadows. So we give the pearl the 3D shapes. Sure, you have to uh, paint the <laughs> paint slowly, don't rush. But here we have uh, to rush. Okay. So you have this result for the a black, and this is for. the white pearl for the gold one. I will only use right now the black for the shadow. I will take the paint at the edge of the brush i uh, don't uh, put all the color on the brush don't dip it and i will make the contour the contouring on the gold This is for shadows. And we can use stippler again. And clean. If you have Okay, here we can correct and here also. This is for shadows. Uh, later on, we will put the highlight with uh, white mats for the gold pearls. I will make with I will use the gray color underneath the pearl here, underneath. And the jewels, the chain. here and here on all underneath all the pearls. Light gray, okay?
Can you see this? You see here underneath, underneath. Here I didn't make any here. Any questions for this stage? Because after doing all the pearls, we fire it on 780 degrees. I, I do that. Any questions? OK. Is light Kubaiba or is heaven? It's like Opaiba, yes. Light, thanks. It's like, not light. MX is like Opaiba. It's a uh, closed medium. After, after firing, you will have this result. Okay, here, here too, I forgot to do something. For the black pearls, for the black pearls, I, I use black and purple. It gives a very lovely color of black after firing it. Mix it yeah. and it's very dark. Look, beautiful. Make sure the pearls are uh, good. Um, the round of the pearls are the same, similar. Okay, after firing it here, here is the last stage of doing the pearl. You can see here the pink and gray, the dot. Here, the mother of pearl underneath. The shadow here. Black pearls. And the gold one. Okay. Now, I will make a wash. For the white pearls, I clean my brush and take only, I moisturize it to clean it very good, very well. I moisturize it. Okay. I use only the Gray color to make a wash for the white pearls. I put a light Here, a light layer of the gray color. On all white pearls. But uh, make one by one because the painting, as I say, it dries. 
before it dries, I have to stippler to choose my stippler. And take off again. The color from the highlight. Okay. And stippler. I'm doing two pearls, two other pearls. Wipe off the color in the highlight. Here it's the last stage, so uh, you can you have to take care of all the details. So if you want to add uh, a drop, you you in here in the middle, add it now. But don't leave it like this. You know, you have to use your stippler again to smooth it and blend the color. I like, personally, I like to make um, a big, to wipe off the, the painting here. So we can see later on the luster after firing it. Okay. And now, we repeat the procedure for all the white pearls. Here I add the wash here without here, here, those one. I'm not uh, here. Those one without wash, those with wash. Okay with only the gray color. I will uh, make uh, a wash for the black pearls again. It will uh, give a stronger color with only black, this time with only black.
for all the black pearls. Stipler. Okay. Wipe off again. Wipe off the highlights, the painting to bring again the highlight. Don't forget where you put your highlights. Can you see this? Okay, can you see this? Here, I make all the... If you find here the lines, uh, uh, lighter light, you can add now more colors. You decide. And now I will mix gray uh, pen oil, pen oil uh, uh, with gray painting to define the white pearls. So I will gi give them uh, a nice tex te texture. A nice uh, outlining. I will mix again. I use my pen. And I redo here the outline. Not all the outline, the one up. And And here for the chain, can you see this? I only make underneath the lower side. outlining only
down. Can you see this? Here and here, here and here. And for the chain here, here and, okay. As here on on the gold, I define the outline. You can make it, uh, you can make the outline with the black, but I prefer the gray color. Okay. Now, We can't hear you, my dear. We can't hear you, Maya. Maya, somehow you have turned off, you have muted yourself. Yeah, no, no, it's, it's because very, of that. Very good. Thank you. The, the stick, yeah, the stick is doing. Okay. okay. This is a white mat, okay? The white mat. I mix it with MX. But I want it sticky, not fluid, okay. Be careful that your spatula is clean, very good. Because with white mats, you, you want a very good, very clean white. Look. Uh, I take my liner. the my liner and try it okay mm. oh very good as you can
can see here, my white mat is, I try here, it's like, uh, give me the relief, like a relief. I use my white mat on the gold pearls. I choose, you have to choose the, where the direction of the light. So if it's from here, so the light it's from here, the shadows, all the shadows are this side. So I, Put my white here, here a dot, it's a little thick. On the chain, I put the dot. On the circle and the straight line. line. Maya, mm -hmm. what is the white product that you're using now called? It's a white mat. I buy, bought it from uh, Catherine Bergois in Lyon. White mat. There's everywhere white mat. Um, otherwise, you can use the the relief, white relief. Yeah. Here, it's not okay one night. I have to clean this. And here too, the first two. Are you still using the MX-54? Yes, for all the color. No. Hmm. MX, yeah. Uh, it's from Saradel, this one, but uh, I used to buy my, uh, my stuff from Paris, so this one is Saradel. As you can see, it's a little curve here to give the round shape. Okay. Well, it is Make a beautiful it. presentation. Um, your piece is gorgeous and you were so detailed in your instruction. Uh, I thank want, you. I want to thank, thank you. Thank you. This is the final result. Beautiful. Okay. Most welcome, everyone. Well, <laughs> here I made here with this piece. I want to tell something. Uh, on this piece, I use mother of pearl on top of the gold. It uh, I don't recommend it 
but uh, it um, gives some effects, antique effects. You can see here, I, I'm not sure you can see. Okay. That shows, that shows up very well on the camera. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. And um, I, I just want to um, ask if anyone has any questions to unmute yourselves and ask them to Amaya about the presentation. Okay, well, um, any, it, no I, questions. thank you, Maya, so much for sharing with us today. And I want to remind everyone that a recording of this, of this presentation will be posted to the IPAT Museum YouTube channel. And then it will be on the ipat.inc.org website along with the downloadable studies that Maya prepared for us. Um, to give you yeah. a little um, uh, taste of what's coming in the future, I thought I would mention some of the presentations that we have scheduled. Uh, we ask that when you see it posted that you sign up um, when, when they're posted. Don't try to go sign up for them all today because you'll forget that you signed up for them. So uh, Friday, the uh, 21st of June, uh, Paula White will finish her second fire grapes presentation. And then on July the 21st, Lynn Patton will give us um, a, a beautiful presentation on painting a chickadee with vegetables. And then Daphne Stevens on August the 8th will give us the Brazilian leopard spotted orchid with texture. So those are some of the things that are going to be coming up and uh, they will be listed in your new issue of the IPAT magazine, uh, the, Ju the July, August and September issue. Um, Audney Thostead is another one who will be helping us out in September, um, of the 23rd of September. And uh, all of these again will be listed in the IPAT magazine. There'll be a little uh, flyer on the IPAT website that gives you all the dates. And then just keep looking for the uh, two um, I, IPAT uh, Facebook pages where I make most of the presentations about the upcoming events. Maya, we really, really enjoyed your beautiful presentation today. And thank you so thank much you. for sharing with us. Thank, thank you, Zanna, for the opportunity. Thank you, Maya. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.